The fire rate of the Shadow Shard or Sunbeam Duet is timed such that as long as you are standing still and aiming down sights, you get first shot accuracy on every single shot you fire, even when you're shooting it fully automatic. Yo, what's going on guys? I've discovered a previously unknown quality of the new Duet Assault Rifle in Save the World, which, by the way, is in the weekly store for 1680 gold. There was a lot of hype around this AR because a couple months ago, the weapon model was accidentally swapped onto the typewriter due to a glitch, so people naturally assumed it was going to be either a reskin or remake of the typewriter, aka the drum gun. If you haven't used the typewriter before, it is an awesome run and gun type SMG designed for hip firing. Almost zero vertical recoil, medium fire rate, and relatively tight blue. Well, the duet came out and the only quality it shares with the typewriter is the drum magazine. The fire rate is slow, damage is good, but the recoil is unusually high for Fortnite, and the bloom is awful. The weapon's description even says, quote, not very accurate when firing on the move. So yeah, if you try to use this like you would the typewriter, you're gonna have a bad time, and accordingly most people think this weapon is kind of useless. You can put a fire rate perk on it to try and force it into the typewriter's shoes, but you still have the handling issues, plus the boosted fire rate makes the bloom problem even worse. But the description also claims the duet is quote, good for sustained fire due to the slow rate of fire. Oh really? Doesn't seem that good to me, even when standing still. And then you evolve it to Shadow Shard, and everything changes. At the 4 star evolution of a weapon, you have to choose whether to make it permanently an Obsidian Ore weapon, or a Shadow Shard Crystal weapon. The Shadow Shard path gives higher damage and impact, at the cost of lower durability and a slower rate of fire. The Shadow Shard duet has its fire rate reduced from 5 to 4.5, which just so happens to be the exact time it takes for the first shot accuracy to reset. To explain really quickly, the first shot accuracy mechanic just means that if you're standing still and aiming down sights with most weapons, the first shot has perfect accuracy and lands exactly on your center crosshair, but with sustained fire the bloom kicks in and your bullets start landing randomly within the expanding crosshair area. The fire rate of the Shadow Shard or Sunbeam Duet is timed such that as long as you are standing still and aiming down sights, you get first shot accuracy on every single shot you fire even when you're shooting it fully automatic. As far as I know, this is the only fully automatic weapon in the game that behaves this way. The closest comparison is clearly not the typewriter, but actually the Dragon's Roar, which is a heavy-hitting semi-auto rifle with the exact same fire rate cap of 4.5. So the Duet is essentially a fully automatic Dragon's Roar with better perks and no longer locked to fire element. With the effect of Zero Bloom, this is one of the few weapons where Weapon Stability Perk actually has a place. The weapon Stability doesn't affect Bloom, it reduces the recoil of the gun, which is fairly high in the duet. Someone in my game last night crafted me a duet with two Weapon Stability Perks, and it's an absolute laser beam. Here's a wall test of the Shadow Shard duet with Zero, One, and Two Weapon Stability Perks. This is a 5 tile range, so that you can clearly see there is some bullet spread from the recoil, but it's night and day compared to the bloom of the non-crystal version of the weapon. I would absolutely recommend using one weapon stability perk in the fourth slot, because the alternatives are just durability, reload, or mag size, none of which are really necessary. I personally wouldn't use a second weapon stability perk though because you have to sacrifice a damage perk for it. As for the perks overall, as you can see I went for a crit build with one crit rating and double crit damage because I was unaware of this first shot accuracy behavior. Now that I know about the accuracy, I think it might be better to go with damage perks. You can even have one damage and two headshot damages. I would say this is one of the few weapons where that setup would actually make sense for the average player. I think that about sums it up. Basically, don't use the duet like a typewriter, don't use the LMG soldier meta aka bullet storm and crack shot where you have increasing fire rate and decreasing weapon stability over time, don't use a fire rate perk, don't evolve it to obsidian, don't try to force it to be something different, just treat it like what it is. A fully automatic precision semi-auto rifle. It'll be in the store for about 5 more days, so May 8th is the last day you can get it. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and maybe even use code EONSHG in the Fortnite item shop. Bye-bye.